Hello. Welcome to the channel. This is a custom mini bike. It started life as a mongoose excursion. In order to fit the engine, which was donated from my old lawnmower, the frame was extended using bicycle bits. The engine, a 6.75 horse Briggs flathead, had to be converted from its horizontal position. To do this, I started by removing the governor, and I welded this section of the engagement shaft onto the connecting rod bolt. This allowed for the engine to be lubricated via splash lubrication in its new position. With the bike put together, it was ready to undergo its first test drive. Disaster. The bike traveled around 70 feet before both chains were thrown off their sprockets. This was likely due to me welding with less than satisfactory precision, which led to a wobble being introduced in the drivetrain. Unknown to me at the time, I countered the issue using various forms of tensioners. After a few rides, it became clear the bike was too slow. I reduced the rear tire size in hopes of sacrificing top speed in favor of faster acceleration. Immediately, the bicycle chains I had been using were torn apart from the torque. This setup required an upgrade. With the underlying issue of the wobble still cursing the bike, the project was put aside for a few weeks. Upon revisiting the bike, I decided I wanted even more power. In this version, I used sprockets with hubs for my jack shaft. Doing this eliminated the wobble and made the jack shaft a removable unit. The chassis was ready for its new engine. For this, I chose a 140cc 4-speed and this proved to be too much for the frame. Using strategically placed gussets, strength was scavenged. However, a new issue presented itself in the form of the rear wheel bearings gaining increasing amounts of play. With this discovery, I made the decision to remove my custom swing arm and start from scratch. Stay tuned to see if the frame will bend in half.